All right, we now focus on a surprising development in the U.S. economy. Inflation, which many hoped was on the decline, has in fact picked up pace unexpectedly. And all of it happened in this August. This could have implications for Federal Reserve policy and your wallet. Now, the U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics reported that the core consumer price index, which excludes volatile food and energy prices, rose by 0.3% from July and increased 3.2% from a year ago. This core measure is often, often viewed as a better reflection of underlying inflation trends than the overall CPI. The rise in inflation was largely driven by higher housing costs, rentals, identified as the main factor behind the overall increase in prices last month. The overall consumer price index climbed 0.2% from July and 2.5% from a year ago. This figure has been trending lower for the past five months, primarily due to falling gasoline prices. With the uptick in core inflation, the Federal Reserve is likely to cut interest rates by 25 basis points next week. The focus will likely remain on labor market conditions, which are a major concern for policymakers. Following the report, traders adjusted their expectations, reducing the chance of a jumbo rate cut next week to near zero. This caused Treasury yields to rise, S&P 500 futures to edge lower and the dollar to recover some of its losses. For consumers, this means that while gasoline prices are lower, you might still feel the pinch at home due to rising shelter costs. The economic landscape remains complex and ongoing adjustments by the Federal Reserve will be closely watched in the coming months.